Hello. How are you? I'm fit as fiddle. How are you? I'm fit as fiddle too. <laughs> <laughs> That is my new phrase. Thanks to you. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks to you, Mr. Joseph, to yes. give me your precious time spending with me. It's uh, really. It's my pleasure. It's my pleasure. It's my privilege. It's your yes. pleasure, then it's my privilege. Yes. So, how was how was your day today? What did you do? Uh, well, I did uh, I did a uh, drive a auto. Your tuk tuk. Yeah, just tuk tuk. That's it only. Okay. How how many hours? Uh, like today nine hour. From still till morning right now nine hour. But you know. I have a, I feel a great remorse right now. And why is because that? It was because you know, one of my one of my you know one of my owner or you could say a passenger called me that uh, uh, he wants to go on a, a, a bus stand you know a railway station. Uh huh. So I I refuse him and I told him that uh, I have something I'm not feeling well well I'm not keeping well. so i cannot go so i feel remorse right now but anyway let's do what happened let's see this is the part of a life we have Definitely. to say you know well, you should say sometime you should lie sometime well it's not really lie but you, the thing is you know you, you in life you have to say no okay yes, you, yes. you cannot you cannot say yes to everything and everybody it's just it's not possible so but I, i'm the same way if if somebody asks me like for something and i have to say no i i feel bad because i like to say yes 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 but it's just not possible so it, it's natural you know when you say no to feel bad maybe you weren't able to help that person out but it, it's uh 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 oh i said can't you should never say can't <laughs> yes but yes sometimes this is the part of say no yeah this this is the part of life we have to learn say no we have to learn to say no you know of course uh, one of my one of my friend told me uh, he is from kerala he told me that we cannot we a single person cannot make everyone happy of course it's not possible yeah. it's not possible So uh, Mr. Joseph I have one doubt before we start I have one doubt look uh, I'm not keeping well since one week okay my head What, is you can say okay, I have not been feeling well so I I you know I have, I'm not keeping well what should I say that that's the right and right correct sentence uh, or it, it's better to say I have not been feeling well for the past week. Okay. So I have been not feeling well for the past one week. My head is paining. So what should I say? My it has been paining or it ha I have been paining. What do what, what is can, the right answer? You can say I ha I have had I have had a headache. So it I have a headache is right now. So I have a headache since past one week. So from past week, past one week, it's a continuous tense. So from past week, past one week to till now. So what should I say then? I've had a headache the past week. Okay. So still now. Yes. Till now is paining. Okay. Yes. Well, okay, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm I'm huh. sorry you have that. I'm sorry that you've been having a headache. Yeah, that I I have been headache since one week. That's that's horrible. I hate headaches. I know it's a, they are very well. They can be very very painful. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Hey, well, today I I want to talk to you about when to use either and when to use neither. Yes. 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 Okay, yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. Okay. So. First things first either means one of the two either means one of the two and neither means none of the two okay so 
if if you are at a store and you see two basketballs and mm. someone says, oh, um, which one do you like? Yes. Yeah. And he's like, and you just say, well, well, either. You can say either. So, that, that just means he, uh, one of the two. Yeah. One of the two mean that you are choosing from from two of the things you are choosing only one. Or not choosing to both of them. Just to, from both of them, you choosing only one. When you yeah. use either. Yes, just one of the two. So you can say yes. either one. Now, now neither neither means none of the two. So they, you, somebody could say, oh, uh, which pair or which which apple do you want? Neither. Neither. Okay. I, I don't want any of them. Okay. Okay. So what 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 happen what what happen if there there is a three three apple out there what what are we gonna use? Um, well, you can say well you can still say neither. They they uh -huh. might say oh which apple do you want? There's three uh -huh. of them. And yeah. You can still say, if you don't want apple you can say oh neither one. Okay, so neither is already a negative word. So we know we don't need to add any negative like not. You cannot. We cannot use not. Huh? Can can we include not in this sentence? Not no. You would just say neither one. Neither one. Just just. I'll, I'll give you an example. That I'll give you an either example. That I haven't seen either of your children. Like do you have a two children? So I'm gonna tell you like that. I haven't seen either of your two children. Or I'm gonna. I'm, I haven't seen your either children. What do you think? Mm, no, you can just say I've never seen your children. That would be better. I've never seen your children. You don't have to say either or neither. Okay, okay. Yes. So simply and only simply said I have what what do you say? I've never seen your children. Your children. Yes. Somebody might say, "Hey, uh Joe, have you seen my children before? I don't remember. Have you seen my children? Oh, I've never seen them. I would say I've never seen them. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. Thank you, Mr. Joseph. Thanks. For, it's a very complicated uh, queries. This is uh, either or neither near for me. But uh, it uh, seems like it's correct right now. I'm feeling it right now. Oh, yes. It's really not... It's not complicated. You, we just have um, to. Sim let's not make things harder than they really are. But I know, I know, a lot of people get confused. Either or neither. They sound, they sound similar. <laughs> yes, yes. But, but I'm glad that you know I was able to explain that for you. Thank you. Thank you.